Greetings! Thank you for your interest in applying to Blockboard's Academy. Tell me, how did you hear of our school? Those fools in marketing laughed at me when I suggested airing it during reruns of Skin City. Well, look who's laughing now! I mean, you have impeccable taste to choose our school. I hope we live up to your expectations. Now, as you know, Blogboard's Academy is a very exclusive school. Why should we select you over the other candidates? Are you offering a bribe? I'll have you know that if word about this gets out, there will be dire consequences. For whichever scapegoat we blame it on, we'll be fine, of course. What major are you considering pursuing? A new field of study. We had to introduce this new curriculum after some former students wound up missing. Some perspective on the lighter side of wizardry after graduating. The parents complain about their children becoming too emo. Very well. If selected, you will be living on campus throughout the school year. Do you have any questions about your living arrangements? Where you're going, you don't need roads. Our school is eco-friendly. Bicycle lanes only, and of course, you can take the train. Any final questions before we conclude? Every year around springtime, a dark presence resurfaces. We call him the tax man, quite a bothersome chap. Make sure to fill out your tax return to the letter, or you're in for a world of pain. Excellent. According to my assessment, I believe you would be a good fit for... House Bravewing. Noble and majestic, you strive to represent the best in all wizards. We shall make our deliberations, and if all goes well, we'll see you at the start of the school year. Farewell!
but a dream. Within a dream. Within a dream. Within a dream. T-U-R-T-L-D power. T-U-R-T-L-D power. T-U-R-T-L-D power. Teenage mutant heroes. T-U-R-T-L-D power. T-U-R-T-L-D power. T-U-R-T-L-D power.
Alright, time to practice some magic. But why did Master send me out here when it's so dark? Aw, uh, I didn't come down here for I'm cold. To you might start some do all this. Move some crates and wake up Frankenball. That should be enough practice. The key to magic is the X button. Or is it the cross button? Well, it makes me stronger, so I'm just going to call it the multiplication button. I can use the imp to throw boxes.
Hello. They denied me, casted me aside, but I will have my vengeance, I will have my chicken nuggets.
game is crap. Hey, you guys. Oh, this is fun, huh? I'm Lois. Hi, I'm Ryan. My name is Peter.
Hey everyone, I'm Roland. I'm Una. Hi, I'm Sparkle. What I'm looking for is someone to cast with. I'm looking to conquer. I'm not a hay digger. I like nice guys. Looking for a magic relationship? I'm on magic because it seems like it's on a much more supernatural level. To find that real magic, that real demigod. Try magic today for free. So if you're not an alicorn poacher, come and find me. Hope to conjure with you soon. Can't wait to beat you. Meet someone mystical. See who's on magic right now for free.
So, when did you arrive here, and how did you get here? Did you fall through a portal like me? No, I just accidentally walked into it when I wasn't paying attention. Oh, 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 what was that? Oh, no, oh, no, oh, 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 Yes, I do. And if you don't tell me now why you were raiding this village, I will shoot you, because I do. Well, we hate your kind. That is why. And also... Too late. What? How dare you kill the Supreme Leader? I'm going to kill you. No, you're not. Ah. Ah, ah. Quick, follow me. Oh, okay. <laughs> Gee, what is this place? I think it is an old abandoned village. Oh, yeah. Hmm, maybe it isn't abandoned. It looks like it has a campfire. Hmm, let's just walk over here. Okay. A bandit! Please don't kill me! Okay! You monster! You killed him! Now give me all your stuff! No! Yes! No! Yes! No! Do it now or else you'll end up like him! Oh, okay! Villager 84, no! <coughs> uh, villager number 24, you must go <coughs> without me.
That's not how you party. You rock the party.
Chicken nuggets. Sorry, sir. The chicken nugget machine no work. You will pay for this now. Whoosh bomb noises. Whoosh bomb Dead noises. Dead McDonald's noises. Sweet home. I finally managed to find the recipe for the community gem winning potion. Now where do I find all the ingredients?
Dream.
Come on. In the record. I'll watch these bloody kangaroos. Let's see what's on the radio. Shazza, what's the emergency? Oh, you're never gonna believe it. 
Little Dundee's vanished. I don't know where he is. Calm down, Shaz. I'll go look for him. It's starting to get dark. You got a flashlight? Oh, cheers, mate. I got one laying around here somewhere. How the bloody hell did it get up there? Some more wood from that tree. And if I'm walking, yeah, I know there's a new wood. Time for an intro now? Well, anyway, breaking news! A local citizen has gone missing. He apparently he has gone to an unknown realm called Earth. Anyway, this realm called Earth is not square. He is panicking and has no food or drink. He has sent us this video by using a camera. Oh, oh, is this thing on? Yes, yes, I think so. Um, hello. My name is Village Number 24. I have been sent to another room and I have been stuck here for nearly a day. I have built a house over here, which is a very cozy house. I have also built a fire over here. If you are getting this message, please send help. 
thing. I'm very scared and I don't know what to do. I don't have any food or water. Just please send help. I beg you. Goodbye. Very, very sad. Tonight's lovely numbers are two number nines, and no another number nine, a number six, a number seven, two number forty fives, a slice of cheese, and a large cup of coffee. If you won the today's lottery, don't come to us. Go to the bank for the fifth time this year. This is the end of tonight's episode of Villager News. Join in next time, which is tomorrow. Goodbye. Ooh. Ooh, yay. I wonder if I caught any animals from my animal trap. AKA the fireplace. I found a cow! I think he's a cow. I think he's dead. Uh. Yay! That cow was very, very tasty! Hmm, I wonder what else I can eat. Hello? Is anybody there? Um, no? Oh, okay. Wait a second. If if no one is there, then how did you speak? I'm a big fat birdie. No, you are bloody well not. And if you don't speak now or come out, I will come over to there with my axe and chop you into little pieces. And then I will eat you too, like I did with that cow over there. Okay, I will come out. What were you doing behind there? I was searching for food because I am very, very hungry. Now well, I will ask you the same thing. Why are you here? It looked like a good place to put my camp, okay? Jesus. There is a village just up north from here. Follow me if you want to come. Can I bring my axe? Yeah, sure. Welcome to the village. It is very nice. But does it get very cold up here in up north sometimes? Oh my friend, it is always cold up north. Okay, but can I buy a house here? And if I can, how much will it be? One emerald. There you go. Thank you, my friend. Your house is just up that hill over there. Good luck in the village. I have a library just around the corner. Come round whenever you want and buy a book maybe. I'm going to go and check out my house just up there. I will see you later. Goodbye. Goodbye. I think I read an audio book. By John Steinbeck. Read by Gary Sinise. A few miles south of Soledad, the Salinas River drops in close to the hillside bank and runs deep and green. The water is warm, too, for it has slipped twinkling over the yellow sands in the sunlight before reaching the narrow pool. On one side of the river, the golden foothill slopes curve up to the strong and rocky Gabilon Mountains, but on the valley side, the water is lined with trees, willows fresh and green with every spring, carrying in their lower leaf junctures the debris of the winter's flooding and sycamores with mottled white recumbent limbs and branches that arch over the... Touch of a witch, I shall deal with the traitor. Really? Fire magic? I will step right the burner. I have forgotten nothing, but I have learned to balance.